Hello everyone. Today we are going to show you where the zero and span features of the Series A4 differential pressure controller can be found and how to use them. The most common feature you will use of the two is the zero feature. The purpose of this feature is to ensure the gauge reads zero at zero pressure. The best way to do this is by exposing the two ports on the back of the unit, removing all tubes that may be attached. Once both ports are exposed, the gauge should reach zero. If it doesn't, you can access the zero feature by entering into the secure menu of the gauge. Based on your current menu located in the upper left corner of the display, you will use the up and down arrows to navigate to the secure menu by holding either up or down for two seconds to move from one menu to the next. By factory default, the zero function is located at the top of the secure menu. Depending on what parameter is currently highlighted, you may need to move the highlight bar so that the zero option is selected. Press and release the check button to start the zero calibration. Once the process is complete, the gauge will read zero offset calibration successful and then will return to the secure menu. Span is another calibration feature you can use, but should only use it if you have the ability to accurately source the full scale pressure. This function is also located in the secure menu right below the zero feature. First apply and maintain the full scale pressure of the gauge. With the full scale pressure applied to the gauge, press and release the check button. Once the process is complete, the gauge will show that the span calibration is successful. Thank you all for watching. Please feel free to check out some of the other instructional videos on our Series A4 Digital Differential Pressure Gauge. For more information on this product and other products that Sensicon has to offer, visit us at www.sensicon.com.